We're group three, and I'm Justin Mar de Leon. I'm Erica Jane H. Cruz. And I'm Jerome Francis M. Pawayan. Reporting the Brillo model of communication, aka Brillo's SMCR model. S for source, communication skills, knowledge, social system, culture, plus attitudes. M for message, elements plus structure, content, treatment, and code. C for channel, seeing, hearing, touching, smelling, and hearing. And R for receiver, communication skills, knowledge, social system, culture, and attitudes. David Burles' SMCR model proposes that there are five elements within both the sources encoder and the receiver decoder which will affect fidelity. Source receiver relationship. Burles' approach is rather different from what seems to be suggested by the more straightforward transmission model, in that he places great emphasis of deity communication, therefore stressing the role of the relationship between the source and the receiver is as an important variable in the communication process. As you will see from what follows, he enumerates what are the factors to be taken into account at each end of the communication. Thus, for example, in principle, the more highly developed the communication skills of the source and the receiver, the more effectively the message will be encoded and decoded. In fact, However, the relationship between skill level of receiver and source needs to be taken into account, since as Berla points out, a given source may have a high level of skill, not shared by one receiver, but shared by another. We cannot predict the success of the source from her skill alone. The monadic approach to the communication app would tell us much about the communication skill level, personal characteristics, etc of both source and receiver. In doing so, it might tell us about the general competence of both, but it doesn't allow us to make any firm predictions about the, like, about the likely success of the communication. The communication studies teacher may have a seductive tone of voice, may be considered by the students to be one of them, may have expert and wide-ranging knowledge of communication theory, may have great enthusiasm for the subject. The student may be highly intelligent, articulate, articulate literate, literate, and diligent. However, if the student finds communication theory pointless, boring, and a load of hot air, then clearly fidelity will be far less than desirable. What about the source of communication? <coughs> also, it applies to receiver. There are five verbs of communication skill according to Berla. Two are encoding skill and speaking and writing. They are decoding skill, listening and reading. The fifth, the crucial, the both including and decluding tool of reasoning. Two, the mayor perhaps with the object that the place such emphasis for reasoning what generation of the electricity electrical skills of the de <coughs> detriment of emotion feelings is unreasonable. As encoders, our communication skill level affects our communication feeling in two ways. Our link to burial. It affects our ability to analyze our own purpose and intentions, our ability to say something when we communication. In effect, our ability to encode messages say what the entire our communication skill. Our facility for learning the language also affect our ability to encode to the we have. We certainly all have experienced the frustration and not being able to find the right word <coughs> to express what we meant to say. Bearing in mind, Carlos insisted on the dyadic nature of communication. We need to remember that finding the right word is not simply the ma matter of finding of which expresses what we want to say, our own satisfaction, it also has to have a and think 
meaning for the receiver as does for us. <clears throat> Message. As you can see from the model, essential elements which, which Brello identifies for discussion under the heading of message are code content treatment. Code. Whenever we encode a message, we must make certain decisions about the code well used. We must decide first which code, second which element of code, and third what method of struct during the elements of code we will select. Content. Content is the material in the message that was selected by the source to express his or her purpose. It, like code, has both elements and structure. If you have five assertions to make, you must structure them. You must impose one or add another order on them. The ways you choose to arrange assertion in part determine the structure of the content. Treatment. The treatment of the message decisions which we should make in selecting and arranging both code and content. In preparing the copy for a newspaper or journalist treats her message in many ways. She selects content that she thinks will be interesting to her reader. She selects words from the code that she thinks her reader will prefer to receive them. <clears throat> channel. In communicating, the source has to choose a channel to carry his or her message. Media buyers. The people in advertising agencies who buy television time or space in newspapers. For example, have to decide what is the best channel or combination of channels. Media selection is limited by first, what is available, second, second, how many money can be spent, third, what the source preferences are, fourth, which channels are received by the most people at optimum cost, and fourth, and the fifth, which channels have the most impact, etc. In everyday life, we have to make similar decisions with a verbal message such as please go away or even some slightly different treatment of, the me of that message. Be as effective as a punch on the nose. That's all. We thank you for listening to our report. This is Group 3 signing off.